Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the channel. Hey, look, today we're going to be cooking some delicious flank steak, and we're going to get to that in a minute, but you know we have to get some fuel in our system, so let's just go ahead and get that gasoline right now. Cheers to my current friends and to my new friends. Woo, baby. Okay, let's get to this flank steak. So I have this delicious black Angus flank from Land of Oz Beef here in Kansas, up by Kansas City's, and this is delicious beef, man. Like, they got the best beef I've eaten in a long time. So one of the things I love about Land of Oz Beef is it's really trimmed well every time I get a piece. It doesn't matter what piece it is, flank, brisket, whatever. It's always trimmed well, and it's really easy to work with. So we're just gonna trim up a little bit you know, of the little fatty pieces, and we could keep them on, because this is a pretty lean cut of meat, but I like to take off these little pieces here. All right, so we're all trimmed up, so now we just have to add a couple ingredients to this bowl here, and then we're gonna go ahead and get this marinade. We're gonna marinate this all day long. First thing we're gonna do is we're just gonna get some Killer Hogs steak rub on here, and you know, there's not a lot that we have to do, no binder or anything like that. This piece of meat is pretty uniform, so we don't have to do a lot of pounding or anything like that. I thought about it, but it's a great uniform piece. Flip it one time and uh, just, you know, grace the other side with some good flavors. So we have some chipotle peppers and adobo sauce. You know, they sell this at uh, any big box store and uh, it, it's some spicy shit, man. So, you know, just telling you that now. All we're gonna do is throw that in there. We're gonna get some nice color and really good flavor from this. There we go. So now we got some chipotle lime flank steak. All we have to do now is mix it and we're gonna let it sit in the refrigerator for, you know, about eight hours or so. Then we're gonna really get the, the fun part. Hey, since we have so much time on our hands, I mean, this is a good time to like and subscribe to the channel, but then also, you know, join me in a break. We'll have a little break, eight hours or so while we're uh, marinating this and then we'll get back to work. Cheers to my old friends, cheers to my new friends. Let's get it, baby. Get it on the grill. Look at that, baby. Look at that. A little chipotle's here. I'm gonna put those back. A little chipotle's in there. All right, nice and hot. We're gonna go hot and fast with this, baby. Hot and fast. Smelling good, smelling good. Let's go ahead and get a flip. There we go. One good flip there. Let's let it go again. All right, let's see what we have. Ooh wee. Smelling good, smelling good. We should be almost ready, we should be almost there. But this side's gonna be, uh, you know, more done than this side, so a little bit thicker. So what we're talking about is more well done over here and maybe a medium on this side, so that's kind of what we want. All right, so our flank steak has been resting for about 15 minutes, and what we're gonna do is pull it off of here Keep that nice juice in there, right? We'll use that in a minute. Get that on the board. Now, well, let me show you. See the grain is running this way, right? So what we're gonna do is cut against the grain this way. Get that old lefty chef going on. So what we're gonna do is just go ahead and get into it this way. Yeah. All right. So let's take a look here and see what we have, right? So what I'm gonna do with this is actually make fajitas, right? So I need this to be cooked all the way through. You ever been to a restaurant and seen fajitas that weren't cooked all the way through? Nah, it's not how that works. So I'm gonna make fajitas out of this. We'll take a big piece out of the middle. My knife is not as sharp as it should be, obviously. All right, so here we go. We got a nice, good looking piece in the middle right here. And I mean, it looks pretty delicious to me, man. So let's go ahead and get a bite of this. All right, got this delicious piece of flank. Man, smelling delicious. Go ahead and get this taste real quick. I'm telling you, hey, nice and tender, juicy. And you know what? Got that lime shining through. That chipotle got a little spice on the back end. Woo, that's pretty good, man. I like it. Hey, try that, it's pretty simple, right? Little can of Chipotle in uh, one line. Good, good eats. I'm gonna go ahead and get these tortillas together and uh, go ahead and get these fajitas rolling. So, hey, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Make sure you like, subscribe, share. See ya.